Prime Minister Dickon Mitchell says within the next 100 days in government, Grenadians should see movement towards addressing the issue of pension payment. In speaking to GBN in an exclusive interview Thursday evening, the Prime Minister disclosed his aim to address the outstanding industrial matters that created tension with workers and employers both in the public and private sectors under the leadership of former Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell. We need to sort of the pension. Um, our intention, frankly, is to have action on that within the first 100 days. Um, so that's one of the next big steps. Um, we really want to address the worker issues in Grenada because we think if we do that, we'll have industrial peace, we'll have goodwill, and then the productivity that we need to move the country forward will, will come on forward. So for the next 100 days, that's really what the focus is going to be on, cost of living. We made certain promises uh, during our campaign. We intend to fulfill that and addressing the situation with our workers in Grenada. We want industrial peace. Uh, we want a climate where workers feel respected uh, so that they can do their job. And that's part of what we want to address. Prime Minister Mitchell also indicated that changes would be made to promote productivity among employees and to enhance the services of government. He reminds the public of his promises during his campaign that no one will be victimized based on political affiliation. I really have no interest in where people's political allegiance lies. The elections are over. And if you work for the government and you work hard, it means I'm going to look good. So I just want you to work hard. Um, if you're competent at your job and you do your job, then I'm fine. If you're not, then there's no point in pretending. It means you either need to be trained or it means you're probably not in an area that you are good at and you may have to be transferred and so on. That's part of growth. That's part of development. If you're not doing a good job in a particular area and you're better suited for it elsewhere, then someone should recognize that that's part of management and be able to tell you. No point in pretending um, and, and leaving you there or simply saying that if I transfer you, people will think it's politics. So I'm not really worried about that. And I, I've said before, the public has nothing to fear. Certainly public workers from our point of view have nothing to fear. Um, I would not have agreed to pay back the teacher's salary um, that was docked if I felt it was the right thing to do. We could have simply said it's not our business. We didn't do it. We're moving on. To the contrary. Uh, and that's because we really genuinely want to address those issues, regardless of who caused it, and be able to move forward. For GBN News, I am Rena Pet Thomas reporting.